Hello, friends. Today, we are delving into a topic that affects millions of lives worldwide, diabetes. More specifically, we are here to tackle some of the most common myths surrounding diabetes. In this video, we are going to explain about five of the most widespread myths about diabetes. So, if you are ready to explore the truth behind preventing diabetes and learn how to make informed choices for a healthier life, let's get started. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button and ring the notification bell so you never miss our myth-busting content. Friends, welcome to our Take It Easy YouTube channel. 5 Myths About Diabetes 1. Diabetes is caused by eating too much sweet food. This is a common misconception. Diabetes is a chronic disease that is marked by high blood glucose levels, which result from the body's inability to produce insulin or respond to it efficiently. Insulin is responsible for reducing blood glucose levels in the body when it is too high. Although eating sweet food may not cause diabetes, a diet high in sugar and fat can lead to obesity, increasing the risk of developing type 2 diabetes. 2. Diabetes only affects people with obesity. While obesity is a well-known risk factor for type 2 diabetes, it's not the only factor, and diabetes can affect people of all body types. Genetics, lifestyle choices, and other factors play significant roles in diabetes development. Type 2 diabetes is often associated with obesity because excess body fat can lead to insulin resistance, where the body's cells do not respond well to insulin. Moreover, type 1 diabetes is an autoimmune condition that has no direct link to body weight. It can affect individuals of all body types, including those who are not overweight. 3. People with diabetes should avoid carbohydrates food. Our body gets most of its energy from carbohydrates, carbs. Digestion breaks down carbs into glucose which powers everything we do, from breathing to walking and thinking. This is why we need carbs and cannot cut it out from our diet. There are many types of carbs. Some raise your blood glucose quickly while others do so slowly. However, carbohydrates are present in a variety of food, including fruit and vegetables, which may also be important sources of other nutrients. Hence, it may not be practical to totally avoid carbohydrates. Consult a dietitian who can offer advice on a suitable diet for diabetic patients. 4. Diabetics can eat snacks or candies with no added sugar or that are diabetic-friendly. Snacks or candies that have no added sugar or that are made for diabetics are preferred alternatives to regular snacks since they may contain less sugar. The sugar in these products may have been replaced by artificial sweeteners. However, snacks or candies tend to be of low nutritional value and can be high in fat. Hence, it would be a good practice to take a look at the content of the products before consumption and to take them in moderation. The term diabetic-friendly can be misleading. It's crucial for individuals with diabetes to read food labels, check the total carbohydrate content, and consider how these snacks fit into their overall meal plan. Even foods with sugar substitutes can affect blood sugar, so moderation and portion control are essential. Balanced and mindful eating is key for diabetes management. It's advisable to choose whole, minimally processed foods, focus on complex carbohydrates, and consult with a healthcare professional or registered dietitian to create a personalized meal plan. 5. Diabetes can be cured. This is a common misconception. While type 2 diabetes can sometimes be managed and controlled through lifestyle changes such as a healthy diet, regular exercise, and weight management, it is generally considered a chronic condition without a permanent cure. Type 1 diabetes, on the other hand, is an autoimmune condition in which the immune system attacks and destroys insulin-producing cells in the pancreas. There is currently no known cure for type 1 diabetes, 
and individuals with this form of diabetes typically rely on insulin therapy for life. It's essential for individuals with diabetes to work with healthcare professionals to manage their condition effectively. While it can be well controlled and even go into remission with the right lifestyle choices, it is not considered cured in the traditional sense. Diabetes management requires ongoing attention and monitoring. So friends, we came to end the video. Understanding the facts and dispelling these myths is crucial for making informed decisions about our health. Diabetes is a complex condition influenced by a variety of factors, and managing or preventing it requires a holistic approach. A healthy lifestyle, regular checkups, and proper medical advice are essential for those at risk. If you found this video informative and helpful, please give it a thumbs up and share it with friends and family who could benefit from this information. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more educational content.